Hello everyone, welcome back. I'm really excited to announce a new feature from Tableworks 0.6.6 Pro, which is AI Table. So from now on, table creation is just another fun. You don't need to think about rows, columns, and contents, and anything else. You just need to think about what do you really want. So let's see how we can configure it and add it to our own toolset. So let's get started. So let's quickly jump into WordPress dashboard and at the very beginning, I think you have installed Tableware plugin. If you don't, I think you know how to download it because um, plugin, add new plugin and then download the Tableware plugin. Go to Tableware and again, click on Tableware to get into Tableware dashboard. So from here, just go to setting and here you need your open AI API key. So to make your journey seamless, the open AI dashboard is clickable. Just click on it. And if you are logged into open AI, then you'd get into your dashboard by this one click. Okay. Just copy your API key and paste it here and just click on the save setting. I've already done this, so I don't need it to do it again. So now let's get into the fun part of the AI table of table bar. Let's go to a post. Okay. Here is a post like top 10 WooCommerce products you will love in 2025. How would it be if we can gather all the data and then we can structure it into rows and columns? Tableberg AI will do it for us. Let's see how. From here now type slash or click on plus. I'm clicking on plus here and search for Tableberg. So click on Tableberg. And from here, see? Here's our new AI table. So click on AI table. Here's the AI table start page. From, as you see from here, you can select three options from prompt, from page content, from image. So I have shown you first the from page content. So let's get dive into it first. So from page content, click on from page content. So see generate table from content. It will analyze this content and create a relevant table. So Here's my post, everything necessary in here. And if you want to add anything more, then you can type in from here. We are just one click ahead. And this is the one click generate and insert table. You will see every process in live. So it is almost finished. And here it is. See? It created the product name, specifications, custom ratings, price and discount. See everything from here and the rest of the thing uh, you can do, which is you can stylize your table a bit. Like you can change the header background color. You can change the even row or odd row background color. Now I am changing the even row background color, which is what this and you can customize a bit like cell padding so table will look a bit nicer and there are lots of customization in table work so you can see how you can manage your table but see if you manually type in this table then it would take at least five to ten minutes now it's matter of five seconds okay now let's quickly see two other options just type slash table work and here's the table bar and click on AI table. And now let's see from prompt as it is self-explanatory, you can type your prompt. And the fun thing is here are some quick templates, just comparison. You can create a quick comparison table. You can read it out, to create a comparison table. All the instructions are already provided here. So this is the work of quick templates. And of course you can manually type in. So, this is it if you want to create a product table then product table is here so let's see let's see first the comparison table how it generates create a modern product comparison table with the three competing products so let's change it like five competing products include product image store ratings for reviews features list with check marks and discount option so i'm modifying this template just to show you this is not just a template you can edit everything from here like every line so let's click on here just generate an insert table 
let's see how it appears well here it is see in the template there was three product i added five so it generated the five and see i modified the template by adding a discount option so it is also added here right in here so you can move it up later on and everything is here here's a placeholder for your image just click on media library and you can add anything like this here so how cool is this you can change the review section you can change the feature you just need to fill up your own things the whole structure is ready for you okay now i'll show you the third option which is crazier than previous two so let's add tableberg again so tableberg and ai table and this option will create your table just from an image so let's see how it works so click on from image and here you can choose your file or you can drop a file so let's see i've already taken a screenshot for this option so this is the screenshot of mine and it is added here so here's an option like it's optional but why don't we use it let's click on data so yeah it's as it is our data table let's click on generate and insert table it will work again it will show us the process oh i feel it exciting So see, here's the customizable table. At first, you might feel a little off, but it is generated in a way which is dark. But if you remember, our reference image was in dark mode. So it also copied the styles of the table. So let's see how to fix it, like how to set it in light mode. It's a matter of few clicks. So just click on the table, click on here, and just go to styles and see here every color. Just you can make them default see and i think our table is just created as my table was in dark mode so it generated the shades of the darks so if you have greens and messengers and other colors of your website then this tool would really handy because you don't need to change every color from scratch these are the three features from AI table from Tableberg Pro 0.6.6 and that's all for today. Please share your experience with us. How do you feel about the new feature? Thanks for watching. See you in the next video.